Hey silver bugs, well it's that time of the week again. Another unboxing video that is. Uh, this time I went again with PPM or Provident Precious Metals and uh, paid by credit card, didn't do a check. I had such a good experience with them last time I wanted to order one more time so today we're going to be drinking a little Heineken this time. We'll go ahead and crack that open real quick and have a taste. Oh yeah, makes me feel all James Bond-like. Back with our trusty little box opener right here. Shipping was phenomenal this time around again. Ordered on a Saturday. Everything arrived here today on Wednesday, so I'm very happy with that. And without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and crack this puppy open. So, same packaging as last time. Nothing really has changed from the way it looks like. Uh, this package is a little heavier. I've got some special coins in there that I've been wanting to pick up for a long time and uh, decide that this would be a great opportunity to do it. So let's just rip this open real quick. Take a peek inside and of course, boom, another inside mailer right there. So we're just going to take that and toss it over there onto the couch. Another mailer. You can hear something shaking around inside. I wonder what it could be. Let's open it and find out, shall we? And yet again, have maintained my, uh, my score of not slicing my hand open, so that's always a good thing. And uh, right off the bat, let's see what we got here. Is our provenant mailer, so. Yet again, nice little thing right there from Provident. Let's me know what I purchased. I'm gonna toss that to the side. I'm gonna take another sip of Heine again. Get your hands off my Heine. As I'm looking in here right now, I see some flips and I see some air tights. We'll pull out the flips first and see what we have. Oh yeah, I've been waiting on these for a while. Some silver. Britannians. Looky there. Oh, so shiny. Two pounds legal currency in the UK. The back. Let's get you a nice clean shot right there, shall we? Unfortunately, this flip feels a little cheap for such an expensive coin. I did pay over spot on these. Uh, about eight eight to nine dollars once you factor in the cost of shipping and everything. Uh, these are 2013's. These are the first year that these have been released in 999 pure silver. Uh, prior years past that they've released these as a um, basically as a sterling coin where you would still get an ounce of silver but you would also have other metals in there to give it more durability so 2012's are commanding quite a premium right now so I'll just have to skip out on those right now but yeah look at that Britannians freaking love it it's a gorgeous coin and these these are what I've been waiting on for quite some times I missed out when they did the initial sell on these so I wasn't able to get these at a good price but um, I, I did yet again pay a decent premium on these probably about eight dollars once you factored in shipping and uh, I hope you guys like these. Australian, I wonder what it could be. One dollar. Let's flip it over and see, shall we? Oh yeah, some kookaburros. Gorgeous coin right there. I know when the 2014s roll around, I'm not going to play around this time and miss out. I want to make sure to pick them up as soon as they come out. This time I'll check my email daily too as well. So I don't miss out. Because uh, if you don't know, these are actually only minted. Uh, 500,000 of them I believe is what they meant. So there is a limited run on these kookaburras right here. And I actually prefer these more than I prefer the koalas. So. Some lovely kookaburras. Give you guys a little time to take a look at everything. A little closer, shall we? 
I'm waiting to see because every year they change up the kookaburra design one dollar Australian so I wonder what they're gonna look like next year yeah guys super happy with my for purchase four coins uh, like I said I was gonna be back to Provident again I didn't realize it was gonna be as quick as it was but uh yeah four coins some Britannians and some kookaburras and of course some Heineken. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing video. I'll have another one coming in a week, maybe a little sooner depending upon when the package gets here. And uh, I'll see you all next time.